and welcome to our channel. My name is Tracy. Bandit's hanging out with me and Chloe's in the other room, but if you're new, welcome. Thanks so much for checking us out. We do all kinds of unboxings, unbaggings, try-ons, get ready with me's, product reviews, and things like that here. Um, I usually have um, one or two folks with me. My trusty sidekick, Bandit, who you might hear or see running about and then sometimes my daughter is in some of the videos it just depends on what she feels like um, she's kind of in that stage where it's not as interesting unless there's food involved so today I have a wantable style edit this is their summer outfits edit I wasn't gonna get one but then when I saw an ad I saw a dress and I was like "Ooh, I really want that dress so I went on and requested it um, and some like you can go through the stream and request some of the things you want. You may or may not get them. You may get some of them. You may never see them at all in a box. So you just never know what the stylist is going to is going to choose for you. So we're going to get into it and see what they chose for me in their summer outfit edit. Montable is a stylist subscription service. You can get it as often or as in often as frequent or as infrequent as you want because they have so many different edits. You could virtually be getting a new box every week um, or you can just put a pause on it or put a cancel on it and then just reorder when you want. So that's what I do. So when I see an edit that I'm interested in, that's when I, um, I order one. So it's a $25 stylist fee but you get that off of whatever you purchase. Here are your items. Now they usually don't have shoes, uh, but I'm seeing flip-flops maybe. I don't wear flip-flops. I can't stand that thing in between my toes. They sent me flip-flops once before, and I very clearly said, I hate flip-flops. I cannot stand that thing between my toes. It bothers me no end. You can see that they listen real well here because that's flip flops. Um, their prices are mostly in line with what you're going to see from Stitch Fix, so you're going to get those same types of brands. They do have, you, know, you, you can get more expensive brands. I just try to stay in kind of the low end, which is by no means inexpensive. Um, although sometimes you will get sale items, which is nice. So they do send you, give you a bag to send back anything you're not going to keep, like those flip flops. These are by Javianas. And um, I mean, they're a nice heavy duty flip flop. They don't have like the little thing sticking out the end. So you could definitely, you know, get some good use out of these if you were somebody who didn't mind that I do. You do get your note from your stylist and your prices. I have a new stylist and it's in hyphen Jellica, I think it says. I don't know. I'll give you a little picture of them. I can't really read it without my glasses. So um, the flip flops, maybe you all flip flop wearers know about this brand I don't know but they're $42 flip-flops now again I mean they are a sturdy flip-flop don't get me wrong but they're still a flip-flop for $42 so even if I was a flip-flop wearer no I could get ones that look kind of like this from like TJ Maxx that's one thing I can find is shoes um, it does have like the little brand right there on there. I don't know. I guess that's supposed to make it extra fancy. They're not going to be very fancy for me. What I do is while I'm, um, when I try on the clothes, I go over the prices with you. So I'm just going to show you what I got and then do a quick try on. This is a W by Wantable and it's green. I'm pretty sure I had this in my stream. It's a wrap style shirt. Love that. All right, this is by Democracy and it's a little tank top with a tie in the center. I do like the edging. Okay, this is by 
West Key and it's just a little top with a tie in the front some three-quarter sleeves I'm not always a fan of those I'm a floral print you know floral prints can go either way for me it is it's got some pretty colors in there but I think overall it almost gives me more of a fall vibe by the colors um just because there's the print underneath but all is dark the Oliver Jeans Company is a pair of white denim shorts, lots of stretch. They are boyfriend mid-rise shorts. This is that dress. They did send me the dress. It actually looks a lot like a dress I'd gotten before from them. Um, so this is by Apricot and it's got like a wrap in the front and then I think it's supposed to be like a midi. So um, yeah and a little tie detail where's the tie right here a little tie detail and then the sleeves very pretty and then some pants now these are by democracy um they're cute I like the pockets I like how it buttons up there. I wish they were a lighter color, even like a lighter tan. Um, very heavy too, they feel very heavy. These have that lining, it's supposed to kind of hold your stomach in a little bit. Um, I don't know that it works all that well, I'll be honest with you. And I did just get two pairs of pants from Stitch Fix by Democracy that I sent back because in that particular area, it just looked like my stomach was pooched out. Um, so it didn't really keep it in at all and then it just kind of had like some gathering in that whole area um, I think this shirt looks very good on me, but it's like hot here, so um, And I have had some democracy jeans that I've liked but they've been the more denim denim if That makes sense versus like the lighter kind of denim All right Like I said, I'm gonna go try some stuff on meet you back here and I'll change the rotation so you can see the entire outfit. I'll be right back. The first thing I put on is the dress. Um, it has some real fit issues. I'm just gonna say that. It kind of is, got this little gape here. I mean, I guess if you wore a tank top under it um, or didn't snap it, it would be all right. All, I like the sleeves. I like kind of the high low of it. Um, but I don't know that I necessarily see myself pulling for this. Um, you know, and I like the other dress that has kind of this tropical feel so much that I thought this would be nice, but it kind of comes off. Um, I don't know, not quite right in this particular one. So this will definitely be going back. I don't even need to see this in another view. This is the Tropical Leaf Ruffle Sleeve Dress in Navy in a large. It is $98. It was a requested item, but again, I just don't know that I like the fit enough. I mean, I would definitely need something underneath of it, even if it were snapped, because this just kind of poofs out. So, um, yeah, I just don't see myself $98 pulling for it. So, outfit number two, I picked this shirt, which kind of feels like it's a little bit small, kind of in the back area kind of through the arms a little bit um it's not a bad shirt all right i put it on with the shorts to try to make it a little bit more summery but i mean i like this little detail in here um i don't mind the sleeve length because it is almost a full sleeve. 
Um, I just don't like it when they're like right there. I don't tend to pull for those as much. Um, I like the little tie there, but again, I think um, the colors just don't say summer to me. I think it's going to keep too much heat in. Now, that being said, I wear sweaters every day because my office is so cold, but I do have to leave my office, so I layer with something shorter sleeved. Um, the shorts are um, $58, a little high priced for shorts. I do have a pair of white shorts that I think they're a little big, but they do still fit me. I don't think I need $58 shorts. And the top is also 58. And again, I just am not really $58 in love with it. So, okay. Uh, two more tops, one pair of pants. So here is the green top, and we already know that this has issues. Um, I'm like a snossage in here. Um, it's see-through, it's too low, it's, yeah, there is just, um, yeah, it's just not a good look. So. I'm going to tell you how much it is, and then I'm going to go put on the other shirt that I hope I have more luck with. This is uh, $44. All right, and then the pants I'm wearing are $68. We'll take a look at those with the other top, though, which I hope fits better. Or this is going to be a real problem for today. All right, hold on. This is definitely a much better fit. <coughs> With the yellow shirt, I like the kind of little detail in there. Of course, I still love a tie shirt because, let's be honest, I'm going to half tuck it if it doesn't have a tie anyway. So, it's going to look a little bit like that anyway. Um, the pants are kind of heavy for the season. Um, I like them. I mean, I like the pockets. I don't, I don't know about the fit. It is a little high-waisted for me. I do like it about right there as far as the rise is concerned, but then I feel like it's supposed to be pulled up because this feels like it's hanging a little bit. But when it's pulled up, there's like this real kind of, it just kind of, makes that area more prominent. But here they are. They do, I mean, I can see why they put the flip-flops in. The flip-flops do have that pretty gold that look perfect for this. I just could never wear them. I even just tried to try them on with this, and I was like, oh, I can't even wear it in that long. Um, but yeah, I like the pockets on here. I mean, I could see myself wearing this to work with a little sweater over it because, I, like I said, my office is snowing in there, but the tank top is $39 and the pants are $68. It looks like everything except for the flip-flops and the floral woven top were my requested items. so. Here is how the pants look. So they are supposed to kind of plug that in. And I don't know if they're too big and that's why they don't do that, but I do want to go down the size and then have to put the button in them. And they're supposed to kind of pull that in and they really don't do that. I do like the color. Um, I like little button detail right there. Um, yeah, I'm not sure. I'll have to kind of think about it. Um, but this is definitely a more me kind of thing. 
um, as far as style wise, you know, it's casual, it's comfortable, it's kind of an everyday sort of, you know, thing. You dress it up, dress it down. Um, you can wear it with a little skirt at the top. You can wear it with a little cardigan or something over it, or even a button-up shirt. You know, something like that. But I like the color. I'm kind of drawn to the yellow. Is it a little pricey? It is. But if it's the only thing I keep in this box, I've already put out $25. So um, there is that. The pants are also a little pricey. Pants, however, I always have a hard time finding things that I like. So when I find something I like that fits well, I tend to not mind paying a little bit more for it. Uh, but I think pretty much everything else is going back. Like I said, the white shorts fit fine. I like them. They're a little pricey and I do have a pair of white shorts from last year that are a little big on me, but um, the price is right. I already own them. So, um, and I only wear shorts once I get home. So I'm not really that worried about a fit or a look on shorts. All right, well, that's all I have for tonight. Please consider hitting the like, subscribe, and notification bell. Leave a comment down below if you would, and hopefully I'll see you soon.